Hello everyone. Welcome to another video. So in this video, I'm going to show you a case study of one of our done for you client. Now, if you don't know what is our done for you program, so in this done for you program, we do everything for our client. Starting from the product research, suggesting them five products every month, validating them the product, and finally telling them which product should they launch. And finally helping them launch the product and manage their advertising so that their products can rank in the first page. We also give them a forecast sheet. Based on the forecast sheet, we tell them how many reviews they need to gather, what is the investment of the first week, second week, third week, whether they're going to make loss in the first week. And if the loss, obviously in the first week, they will be making loss because there will be a lot of investment like in, uh, images, their price will be lower. And also the ad costs in the first few weeks are high. So we give them the exact forecast. Like this is what you're expecting in the first week, second week, third week, fourth week. So we give them an estimated data based on our experience and the product sales that we are looking at by analyzing their competition. I'm going to show you some example of forecast sheets as well along the video. So this product, let me just share my screen so that I can show you the client's case study. So if we just see here in my screen, I'll just change the date range to last 30 days. You'll see they have received around 48 units, but this is very uh, normal, which I'm trying to sh uh, share with you is the kind of a cost that they're getting with just three reviews right now. So if I just go to the reports, business report so that we can see how many sales or units they are selling right now. So I'll go to the sales and traffic. Let me see. So I'll set it by month, last three months. Then I'll do for product sales. So here you can see this is August and this is September. It's been just 14 days and they have already started picking up in their orders. So here you can see they have generated in the last 13 days, they have generated 28,000 rupees, which is a new launch product. It's been just 14 days. They have only three reviews right now. This is not interesting because they already have increased their price to the top price, which is 588 rupees. Yes, this is an Indian client. So let me just sh share you their advertising dashboard so that you can see how it is moving. So here you can see on, uh, obviously they have launched the product in the last 14 days and it, they have generated around 48 units in sales and which is not interesting so much because that is normal when a product is just 14 days old with just three reviews. This is a normal kind of sales that we are predicting. But if I just go to your, the, the advertising dashboard to show you how much their A costs, that is something which is mind blowing because that really implies how the product selection is. So here you can see in the last, this is set as lifetime, obviously, because it's just 14 days old. We can also select by last 30 days if you want to last 30 days. Let me just zoom it out a little bit for you. So here you can see last 30 days, here you can see that A cost is at 15%, 15.85%, and their spend is around 3,200 rupees, then that is generated to 20,000 say in sales, which is really mind blowing because they have just three reviews right now, only three reviews which is mind blowing to see. So uh, if, if I just show you how much their profits are, let me just take their A sign. So they're already profitable with this product in just 14 days, which is really mind blowing because we have predicted at least four weeks after they will see their first profit based on the forecast sheet. But here we can see they're doing really good. So I'll copy the A sign which obviously I'm not going to show to you guys. I'll copy the A sign and I'll paste it in 
So their product selling price is 580 rupees right now. And their cost of this product is 210 rupees. So we are estimating to increase the price a little bit more because they are already getting good sales with just three reviews. So I'll paste the A sign here. Now, if I just come down here, you can see the item price 588 rupees. Then I'll put the cost of goods that is 210 rupees, including DST. And here you can see the margin is coming. The profit is coming per unit as 180 rupees and 30% net profit. And they have already sold around 48 units, right? And this is just 14 days in the, the first 14 days. Generally, we don't see profits in any of our clients products. Generally, we, we wait till first month to see good ranking and that implies to good sales and good profits. So here you can see they have sold around 48 units. Obviously, there's some amount of profit will go to the ad cost that is around 3,200 rupees. So they are still left with almost really good amount of profits, right? So this is a hefty margin that they're getting at the initial price that they have set. Now, obviously with more reviews, their ranking will be much more better and they will start making more organic sales and the A cost will further decrease to a greater amount as well. So this is this was a case study of this account. Now, let me just show you how the forecast sheet looks like that we prepare for our clients. Let me just zoom it out for you. So if you see the screen, you'll see we, we do an estimation on, this is just estimated data that we share to the client so that the client has some idea about what they can expect. Obviously, this is not accurate data because we can't predict or guarantee if this is the result that is going to come because we ultimately make our decision based on data. And when we are running ads on a, a product, it may happen that in the first week we predicted 10 sales. Instead of 10 sales, we started getting only five sales. That may happen because ultimately it is Amazon's algorithm and it depends on multiple factors like reviews, image quality, how much CTR your image is driving, how much conversion it is listing is generating. But as an advertiser, our goal is to make sure our client is on top of it and make sure we suggest them changes and do it ourselves so that they get best out of their product listing. So we make decision based on our data. This is just estimates that we give to our client. So we estimated here, you can see the week one price, this one that a total sales per day, this one product cost per product is this one. Total cost for seven days is this one. Total product cost per day, then images cost, A plus content, PPC cost. Then we have total loss per day. Obviously, when we set our product, when we launch our product, we set it as a price at a price which will be either at a small loss or which will be at break even. Now, generally for this product, it was set at a loss because the client was eager to lose some amount of money. Now the reviews required, we also give them the targets that this is the amount of reviews that is required. And here you can see uh, the amount of investment that was required for this product. Now this was a big product. For this product, the investment was a little bit higher. And here you can see the week two, same way, week three, week four, all this are making loss because we were losing good amount of money because the client was eager to rank well. Now this is not typical scenario. We can obviously decrease the ad spend to make it profitable, but it again depends how long you want to make your keywords rank well or not. How many keywords you want to rank well. Here you can see uh, week fifth or fifth week, they started making some profits based on a projection sheet. And that way goes, we predict till 10 week uh, at the top price, they are, they are making a profit of 6,000 per week. So every product we suggest we share this kind of uh, forecast sheet for the client so that they can understand what can be expected from this product, how competitive it is, because the more competitive it is, the more loss you have to bear in the first few weeks. So that was it for this for this case study. I will bring on more case study of our done for you program. And if you're interested in the done for you program, obviously it is closed right now because we take only five clients every six months. So if you're interested, there's a link below. You can register yourself. You can fill up the form and join our waiting list. And once we open it again, we will make sure we notify you so that you are on top of it and you can register. Thank you so much. I'll see you again in the next video.